Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's one and only. Today I wanted to bring you a different type of video. I posted on my um, OnlyFans with Juanito, or what is it? OnlyFans one and only on the Fair Play server about the possibility of making a video for you all regarding um, like coins and gems, how to spend it, the best methods for getting parts. And I just wanted to show you exactly how I do it myself. So as you guys can see, I am here on my alt account. Um, I have quite a bit of gems. Yes, those are all legit. In fact, I had way more than this. <laughs> as you can see currently, oh wait, let me go to my garage. I'm at 6,682. And I, may, I planned this also, as you can see, if I go to the scrapper, I don't have any excess parts at the moment. And I'll show you how I get all of those. Just before we get started, I also wanted to show you my vehicles because um, I want this video to also complement what I what we talked about in the Fair Play server regarding uh, F, the garage power management, and I mentioned things like what to upgrade, what not to upgrade, to make it the most efficient possible for the best possible garage, especially if you're not maybe investing too much in gems or you you don't play you haven't played for a long time i think a lot of people they think maxing out your vehicle is the most important thing and many don't realize actually that the parts are sometimes if not most of the time more important than the upgrades of the car itself so if i just quickly show you for example my moonlander here um, you guys can see everything maxed the most important things here actually are the thrusters and the brain the brain because um, if it's not maxed, you can do this thing at the start where you can put it on the two wheels when you hold both pedals and the thrusters for obvious reasons, you're always going to be using the thrusters. Uh, the grip, the grip, I left it at 15. It hasn't changed. I haven't had to use it in anything else. Like I said in other, the video, as you can see, all my parts on the supercar are 17. Sometimes I bring them higher, like if I have some excess coins, like I try to be very... Um, like safeful with my coins with my alt account so for any new team event i try to use only a maximum of 1 million coins if i have if i don't use 1 million coins whatever i have left let's say i used 900,000 the the 100,000 left i'll invest them into upgrades for the car just to make them slightly better because i'm eventually going to max it so as you can see all it's 17 uh, my bike uh, you saw the engine 18 because this event i didn't use too many coins so i invest them in the engine uh, my hot rod 17, my racing truck all 17, um, formula 17, 18. My rally is going to be a little bit higher, yeah, all 18 because it's the car I use the most, especially during the cups. Um, mono wheel, in fact, my mono wheel is really high. There's no need for it to be this high. Um, snowmobile, it's pretty cheap, so I mean, you don't have to have it like this. The one thing I would say is have the fuel tank at max. And any car that has fuel obviously have them at max, so you'll see, look, my tank has max, my chopper has max, diesel, it works best max, and you'll see, like we mentioned, some of the parts, you can max them, like the wings, the jump shocks, the landing boost, I just, I haven't used it. The last event I used this was in the no fuel in lunar, in the moon, and with no parts, it's pretty easy because you bounce so much, so, but anyway, well, anyways, I would probably max them. Um, a rotator there you go and i mean these vehicles you'll see them higher than 18 but i mean probably max because they're really cheap it's not like the supercars and all that are like 200,000 coins for the last upgrade uh, look at this on my dune boogie the world cage 15 there's no need to have it higher balance 15 let's see what the damage on my tractor is 13 and look how look how cheap it is it's only 17,000 coins but there's there's just no need here as well um my bus uh, in fact i had my bus maybe a week ago on 15 15 15 15 and it worked fine i just did it because again i had some coins i, I like seeing my <laughs> garage power increase uh, my scooter the same thing anyways so you'll see so basically my method for running cups is uh, especially once i've finished the season itself i choose the tracks that i like so if you see now the next one is dirt rally it's pretty easy but to be honest with you i don't like it because it's four tracks and it's very slow 
So I exit, I lose 180 points, which to be honest, I don't really care. And I choose one that I like and it's easy to finish. So Beach Cup, you know what, it's pretty easy. Here are my parts. And uh, let's do this nice and quick. I'll run a few just so you guys can see what it looks like. Probably in the video, I'll put some more footage and just speed it up. And if you want to copy my setups, they're not that great, I'm going to be honest. I just make them efficient for myself. This is just using the rally car. There's some cups that I run with other vehicles and hopefully we get to see some of them. But um, for the most part, I just enjoy the rally because it's easy, it's relaxed. Most of the time when I'm running cups, especially on my main account, I'm doing it while also like watching a movie or videos. So really, I mean, trying for like the World Cup setups, which sometimes can be pretty complicated, uh, I don't really do it. Uh, unfortunately, I don't know if you guys saw, and I'll do it maybe the next cup, but going into the third track, I had six points and the second guy had four points. So normally, if, uh, I mean, because the difference was only two points, I do the third track, I had to finish it. But um, if it was three point difference, I would have died in the beginning, like just reversed and died because I knew I would have won. So we'll, I'll show you what that looks like. Anyways, moving forward, my way of doing cups and getting coins and stuff, I open every single bronze chest, whether it's uh, the free ones like for VIP or just even with gems, I open them all until I get a chest that's golden or higher. So, I mean, what's the name of them? So a, a rare chest or higher. I always have one of those running. So let's see, this one is also pretty easy. Again, with the rally, <laughs> honestly, for me, there's nothing better than this, to be honest. It's just nice and easy. But yeah, I mean, this for me, this is the best method. I've told, uh, actually, I didn't make this up. I mean, I'm sure most people do this. But um, as you guys know, it's really expensive to buy coins and even parts or chests in the store of the game. I think a rare chest is like 200 gems. Well, when you play cups, it's only like 32 or something like that. So even though it takes more time, I mean, you're, you're gaining coins from running the cup or yeah, the tracks itself, you know, you're gaining experience learning the tracks and all of this stuff. Oh, that was trash. And um, yeah, it's just, it's much better. It's, it's maybe slower, but if you have the time and you have the effort and the motivation, it's much better. Because if you just waste your, your gems in the store, trust me, like, 36,000 gems in the store will, won't last you. You could literally buy two sets of 750,000 coins for that amount, and I'll show you. Look at that. For Oh, no, for 5,000. So for 5,000 gems, you get 750. I mean, it, and for, with the same amount in cups, you can get like 2 million. So it's really not worth it. So just keep doing this. And... I'm waiting to get a cup where I can be six points above. Actually, I really don't like this cup. I'm going to skip it. Uh, cup seed of water. Okay, that's a good one. This one is actually the world record setup. I just, I don't have my max, my parts max or my vehicle. But this is the setup if you guys want to use it. It's, uh, at least for the first track. It's um, OT, afterburner, and coin boost. Oh, I messed up the timing there. But yeah, just keep repeating. Again, you can set your own rules. Um, it's pretty easy. Uh, I don't know some people maybe like you going for like epic chests or higher. I mean, the epic one is the highest, never mind. But you know what I mean. So just play around what you like to see. I've had 36,000 gems for a while actually because I haven't been playing all that much on my alt account. I'm trying to get 10 million cup points on my main account. And I hope I'll make a video about that soon. If you guys are excited for that, let me know. And see, so just rinse and repeat. And look, I mean, we ran what, like three cups? Let me show you quickly what that looks like in parts. Again, by the way, this account is only a few months old. Like it's not even a year yet. I'd say it's maybe nine to 10 months, maybe less, probably less. I started getting excess parts maybe after the first six months. And I wasn't scrapping anything. I just ran cups, opened as many chests as I could, 
And look, look how many scraps I have in three. Actually, that, that wasn't great to be honest, but I only opened like two chests, three chests. It's, it's pretty easy. And look, how many scrap do I have already on this account? 250,000. So it's nice and easy, really. Um, anyways, oh, let's see if I can get a, I really want to show you guys the, <laughs> the six points trick. I'm going to try it this one. I think this video is going to be a little bit longer than I intended, but <laughs> it's okay. I hope you guys don't get bored. Also, let me know which which cups are your favorites to run. Um, for me, the one you just saw, the Cup City of Water, is one of my favorites. I think it's really fun. In the beginning, I didn't used to like the water tracks, but over time, I, I don't know, I just, I grew fond of them. I think with a formula, that they are really, really fun to run. So if you guys want to try them out, let me know what you like in cups, or if you don't like cups, I just, I enjoy cups. I think they're nice and quick. I don't have the patience to run an adventure because you make a mistake and you have to restart and it takes like 30 minutes. Okay, let's see here. Okay, so if you guys can see here, I have six points and the next one after that has two points. So as you know, you get three points for first place. So I know here that even if any of them get first place, the most any of them are going to be at, it's five. And even if I get last, I'm going to get zero, but six is going to be more than five. It's easy. So watch, I'm just going to reverse. And even one of the guys is doing the same, actually, their ghost. That's pretty funny. And see, first place, I saved myself, what, 20 to 30 seconds on a track. Oh, nice. I'm going to open this just for you guys. Oh, nothing special, but more scrap. So let's put that there. But you saw that. I mean, it, it doesn't feel like much of a saving timing, but imagine doing this for one, two, even five hours. I mean, you're literally saving half an hour to an hour. It's really, really helpful. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought. Like and subscribe as always. I'm trying to get hit 200 subscribers now. <laughs> oh man, that was lame. But <laughs> yeah, anyway, see you guys and I hope you enjoyed it. See ya. Pop it like a pussy.